guys and welcome back to another review video. So you you yo you you yo yoji however it said sent me another parcel. Didn't know this was coming, this was totally unexpected. And they have sent me other things that they sell on their site. Some which I've never seen before. So I'm just gonna go through the things that they sent me and I am going to try out a few things. Whether they go in this video or another video, I'm not quite sure because I don't know where to use them yet. So the first one is a the, some cuticle nippers. I'll have to use these out to see how they are, but they're not the strongest. You know what I mean? They they don't they're not strong. I've I've got some that are quite harder to do. I've got no cuticle to get rid of, so I'm gonna have to use them. But they are huge. <laughs> That looks like a wishbone, doesn't it? Like you can put your finger on and go like that. So I will definitely try these out the next time I do my nails. They will be interesting to see how well they work. New companies that send me stuff, I'm always really dubious of how good their items are going to be and I always expect things to fail. Especially with this company for some reason. My past videos, I was expecting a huge fail. And I have definitely got the utmost respect for Yoyoji because their stuff is really good. I wasn't expecting it to be this good. I am really impressed. So yeah, all power to Yoyoji. Next are these nail forms. And obviously these aren't ones that I would use because I wear long nails. Mine would literally be down to the end if I use them. Plus the for square nails. But I will probably use these in a video just to see how good they are. And I always like to know how well the sticky bits stick on. Next they sent me some more poppets, jewel forms. I don't know quite why they've sent me these because I had some of these in the last two reviews that I did and well I used them in the last two reviews and poppets last for ages so I'm not quite sure so I am going to do a giveaway soon so I'm going to put these in that giveaway because these poppets are really good I was very very impressed so I was chuffed really chuffed to see that in here is the same thing as Madame Glam but you usually hasn't got any name on this so it's a spatula at one end and the brush at the other this is the best thing to use to get polygel, acrogel out of the tube. Uh, this brush is absolutely useless, it really is. I know people were giving me advice on how to use it, but as soon as, it's not how I was using it, it was because it was going in the slip solution and the slip solution was just making the bristles ruin and you know, this is useless. Definitely use one of these if you're gonna use acrogel because it's brilliant. But because I have got two of these off Madame Glam, I will also put this in the giveaway. So they have sent me some more natural clear. Let's see if there's a thing on there, yeah. Again, I will save this and put this in the giveaway. This clear is really good. I'm pretty sure I had some from them last time, did I? Yes, I did. So I will save this for the giveaway. If you want to see my other videos of you, Yoji, because some of these items that they've sent me I already have used. I will leave a clickable link at the end of this video. Their slip solution again, I've already got some of this, so this should be brand new as well. I'm not kidding you guys, this smells amazing. Oh my life, I could wait just perfume it, it really is nice. So they've also sent me some brushes and wow, that one's really tiny. Can you see that one there? Wow. These are obviously for nail art but I don't do a lot of nail art and what I do, I use other brushes. So with these, I will also put in the giveaway and there's no use me just putting them in a drawer and never using them. So somebody might as well get the use out of them. So these will go in the giveaway. Right, down to the nitty gritty. They do gel polishes, which I was really surprised about. So let's have a look at these. This one is, I don't know if you can see that, it says Red Wine Series. So this is like a brown colour, like a brownie red colour. I will test these out and we'll have a, have a look how good they are. The next one is 003. This is a red, obviously red wine series. They're all, they should all be different colours of red. The last one is 001 and this one is red. That looks very much like that red. 
I know it's slightly lighter than that bread. So I will try these out on some nails to see what they look like. Now, <laughs> I don't use gel very often in the slightest. So they've sent me two builder gels, both in clear. Um, one is half an ounce and the other is two ounces. This reminds me of a company that I used to use years ago. It just looks so, the packaging looks so familiar to me. Anybody else get them vibes? What, I can't remember what the company was. That looks so familiar. Anyway, oh my life, hate them. Let's get some cuticle nippers on them. Don't pull it all off because I want to be able to pour it back on when I've finished with it. Wow, that is hard gel. Wow, that's not even coming. That's literally hard gel. That's not even coming out the thing. Wow, okay. I wonder if I can stick um, nail art on and stuff with this. That might be interesting to see. Okay. I love that song by the by the way guys I love Halsey love her songs and the the new the new song 11 minutes oh I just can't get that out of my head I absolutely oh I love her I was following Halsey before she was famous and now she's famous I'm so proud of her if you don't know who Halsey is go go check her out on YouTube I guarantee you will love her music In here, okay, we have another lid. Wow, that is mega full. That is mega full. Whoa, oh, that looks so satisfying. So this gel looks a little bit more on the softer side. I'm going to try these though and see, I don't do gel nails but I'm thinking of trying them because I do get asked by people to do gel nails and what I could do, I could mix some glitter with this gel and put it on a nail. I might try that in a different video but for this video I am going to try and see how well these keep big crystals on. I'm not going to use this one so much. I don't know why they've sent me two to be fair. But I'm going to see if this one, because it says strong, I'm going to see if that one holds big nail art. Other than that, I am going to get these three gel polishes and put them on some nails, because I've got no nail pops left, so I, you, I just have to cope with normal nails. And let's see how these look. So I've got to say, putting these on, it is really easy. They are very smooth to put on and they are one coat. And the pay, the color payoff is gorgeous with them. They have got a sticky layer, so if you wanted to file them after putting them on your nails, then you'd just get the tacky layer off. But other than that, just put top coat on and you're good to go. I'm, again, really impressed with these gel polishes. They are absolutely beautiful.
you can see this one is number one that's number three and that's number six one and three are very similar but this is slightly darker but yeah the color is really amazing to be fair for one coat so now I'm going to get some big nail art and I'm going to put it on the lightest one which is this one and I'm going to see if the gel works holding huge nail art on nails so this is my tre treasure trove of goodies. This is where I keep all my nail art. Look at that, guys. Just look at the splendor that is bling, like just bling. Right, so some things that I don't use very often, I'm gonna try one of them because that is huge. Please don't ask me where I've got all these from. They are from loads of different places. I've got no idea. Uh, what's another one? Let's see about a bow Okay, one of these because these are quite heavy if I can get my hands on them These are really quite heavy. So let's see how good this gel is and I'm going to use one of my things from Madame Glam This is so I'm not using the one from you Yoji just to let you know, you know contamination and all that So in here is already your Yoji's <laughs> that's such a mouthful, your Yoji's slip. I need paper towel so I don't get it everywhere. So where is it? So I'm gonna put this on here to get a, a lump of this. Let go, let go, okay. So I'm gonna put that there and then I'm gonna get this one and Plonk it on there. Oh wow, that looks so pretty. Oh my God, the blue with that red is really nice. Right, so I'm gonna cure this for 60 seconds and let's see if these hold. All right, so just so just I don't get covered in it, I'm just going to get some wipe off solution of Neos and try to get rid of everything that's sticky because I am just covered in it. So this, this one here isn't sticking, that one's just coming straight off, which is a shame. This one, have a go. Oh, that one's stuck. Okay, that one, that one, that one's heavy. That one's definitely stuck. So let's have a look at the bow. Oh, the bow's stuck as well. This might have just been a bit too heavy for it, maybe, because it really is a big thing. Well, I'm gonna clean that up and I'll save that. Okay, guys. So that was the end of this review slash demo. Um, again, I would absolutely recommend you Yuji. I really like their products and I'm really impressed with the gel polishes as well. I'm so glad that they sent me these because I didn't know that they sold them. And again, this video could have gone horribly wrong, but you didn't. All right, guys, I will leave you Yoji's details in the description box. I will leave a clickable link at the end of this one if you wanted to go and check out the other videos I've done for them. And thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.